Michelle, 236 days in. Michelle, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? Hmm. She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but I still worry. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Okay. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? Uh... As yeah. long as it doesn't distract from keeping this place safe, that's always the priority. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman. You've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. <laughs> in that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Uh... Okay, but be careful. People's lives depend on those. We can't have them screwing up because we got lazy. Yeah. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Watchdogs? Sure thing. Okay. Whatever, I guess. Let's go and talk to Becca. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you going to find out? Yeah, in a sec. Uh, what about um, Stephanie? You guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Okay, I guess we're going to go... Um, hello? <laughs> There we go. Go out and help the Roman guy there. See what he's up to. Uh, coffee machine. Oh, lovely. Uh, anything else? Look at light. No. Use pantry door. Is that what we're going to do? I guess so. Steer soup. Smells good. Might as well do it. Okay, so pen uh, use pantry door. Let's do it. Okay, Ellie door. Oh, oh you scared me. He's really? hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. Is that um? The watchdog? Can't disagree with the you there. The quote-unquote watchdog? You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. Mm. I know, I just want her to have a little more time to be a kid. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. Yeah. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out for a mouse or something like Looking that? Looking forward to that soup. Squirrel? I don't know. Let's go and check it out. Uh, look at Walker. Okay, let's do it. See what it's up to. Oh hey, buddy. God. What are you eating? A dog? What is, is that a duck? I think it is. Okay, can we go back inside, I wonder? Talk to Walker. Um, I don't know what I was expecting from that, really. <laughs> 
So let's just go back. Oh my god, I got it. <laughs> oh, Jesus, don't ever fucking do that again. Whoa, what's your problem? I do this all the time. Uh, you don't get all pissed off. Just leave me alone. I don't want to talk about it right now. Dude, what the hell? If something's wrong. Tell me about it. It's the walkers. I guess they got a hold of a puppy. Oh, a it puppy? was? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was... It was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but... After a while, you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. It is. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right? But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... Now it's gone. And now it's gone. Yeah. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. That's a horrible thing to say, really. Shell! Becca! Something's going on outside! Oh god, what, what is now? it? I don't know, something bad. We gotta find Roman. Where are we? Is it a diner or something like that? Oh, it was Come the here, diner everyone. from the the first um Come on, we gotta find that Roman. we saw in Vince's story, right? This month. It's so care to be there. Jesus. Largum. My God, Largum. what did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Uh. What did he take? Food, medicine, whatever he could get his hands on. Usual stuff. I couldn't get any other information out of him. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck in. The second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on but his what way. what if there are more of them? He yeah, that is true. Out. That's right. Mm. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore. If you think about it, in the world right? of Walking Dead, you can't just let him go. It's too dangerous. It's too Who dangerous. knows if he has friends waiting to attack? Don't you think we would have seen someone by now? At least trying to negotiate to get him back. Uh. That is strange. That doesn't mean anything. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost uh. Bree, and then Vernon uh. with that goddamn boat. Uh. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. Vernon is that He made us beat up that guy with the mustache is and he did? his boat. We did that. I've regretted it ever since. Okay. The more you know, I guess. That's when our group fell apart. Oh, these are the... He can't stay these here. These are some of, uh, of the folks I from agree. that... from uh, him here is not an option. What do you call it? From his uh, Vernon's group. would be a drain on our resources. Oh, okay. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this That's guy go pretty cool. and take our chances, or we kill him. It's only been like two weeks yeah. or so. Uh. You're right. It's only been two weeks or so other. since I actually finished, uh, finished uh, what you call it, season one of The Walking Dead. We are so. letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I still remember a couple of things from that. the game, to be honest. Him? Um, Is that really the answer? It was answer? a great game, none of this. Stephanie. Boy, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? Fucking... I don't know, kill him? We can't take the risk. We kill him. There's gotta be another way. Tell me, what if he comes back? With weapons, or, or a gang? Is it worth losing any one of us? No, it's not. Jesus. There really is no other choice, is there? No, Stephanie, there's not. We can't keep him here. We can't let him go. Let's mock him. But there's even so a chance of him coming back, or telling folks that might try to hurt us. We can't risk it. I won't ask you to watch. But if we do this, we're all in it together. If this ever happens again, it's gonna be one of you pulling that trigger.
shoot him. There we go, thank you. 259 days in. Red Stein. Nope. Nope. Oh, we got a new Do shirt you have on. Any sevens? Uh, yeah, yep. sure. Here you go. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Because it's a different time, After idiot. After we had to kill that guy, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I wish things were still like they used to be. Well, Roman's too focused on making sure no one's able to break in again. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Uh... Did anyone see you leave? No, no one saw me. You've got to stop doing that. You're going to get us both in a lot of trouble. She is my sister, so I kind of have to We've protect her, this, even though I just last don't month. like her character. Uh, I don't Becca, know why. You know what I just don't like the kid's character for some reason. You back here. No one is following me. Yeah, Same with Doc in there. season Yo, one. Need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Uh. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't fucking know. I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Okay, so, w what are we gonna do now? Go talk to them, or...? Can you see that box over there? Right here? Yeah, that thing was glitching. Look, it's jumping up and down. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, let's talk to Boyd. Hey! Shell, it's Stephanie. What? Roman's got her locked up like some kind of animal. They said she was trying to escape. They actually used that word. Escape. Boyd? Calm down. I knew something like this was going to happen, Shell. I said if we killed that man, we were heading down a dangerous path. And now look where we are. I'm gonna go talk to Roman. No, no, just take Becca and get out of here. You know I can't do that. Things are good here. We just have to stick together and follow the rules. Just don't do anything stupid. Uh, da -da -da, Joyce, I don't really want to talk to her. I don't know. Um, I'm, uh, we might as well, why not? Hey, I heard about Stephanie. Why did she have to do that? We're safe here. There's no reason to want to leave. I'm sure she had her reasons. I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Well, if she wants to leave, then... Let her go. <laughs> I never really understood that, but okay. She's no stranger, so... Roman? I don't know. Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Uh... Well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Um... Ah, it doesn't matter. It matters to me. No, well, fuck you, Last Roman. Last time we did this, we agreed that next time it'd fall to someone else. I'm asking you to do it. Uh, but she's one of us. But she's one of us. Th this is different. No, she's not. Not anymore. When she tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. 
She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what the fuck is this guy's problem? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Xiao? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? No, not really, but... Uh... It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. Yeah. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? Uh, she did what she did. Because this place isn't safe anymore. Ever since we killed that stranger, things have been different. Roman's not trying to protect us anymore. He's trying to control us. But it's safe here. I mean, yeah, I want to get away every now and then, but I would never leave. That's crazy. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Ugh. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. Do I? Are you okay? Do you want to talk about it? No, I don't. I just want to get it over with. I seriously hate this girl here. Grab keys, grab pistol. Uh, so is that escape? Or shoot Stephanie and stay? Well, I'm gonna escape. If that is the no, case... No, we don't then. have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know, longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. Uh... No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. Just escape, so goddammit. Yeah, it does. Shell, it's time. Drive away or kill Stephanie. Drive away. What are you doing? Shell? Shell, what the hell? Sit down, get safe. Shell! Hey! Shell! Can we save her? I promise! Now we won't! What the fuck? No. God damn it! Was that it? Paradise Lost. I guess that was it. So, next time on The Walking Dead 400 Days, we are gonna take on Bunny Story. See you guys then.